of all, congratulations to all three of you ladies. Thank you. A very good job. So first, tell me a little bit about the scenario and the, and the roles you guys play in this film. Um, well, I play Patricia. I play the uh, snobby, rich girl who is the kind of girl who hangs out at in-style parties with Paris and, you know, Paris Hilton and, you know, very much the, the snob, you know, who just thinks that she hung the moon and every person should just do what she wants. And she's also the girl that doesn't really know who she is yet. She's, she's like, I play the youngest girl and, like, the pure, innocent, but yet really kind of afraid of who I'm going to, who I am and trying my darndest to not be who that person is. So, um, so I, you know, I play the, play the girl that needs a man. I am Lorena Morales. I'm a lawyer, very conservative, very serious, very neurotic. Um, that through the movie she realizes, um, because of the friendship that she develops with the two girls, that, that you can be beautiful and, and, and successful, sexy, sexual, all at the same time. I'm Cece. I'm the crazy Latin dancer. Mm -hmm. She's very loud, very over the top, big hair, big makeup, big boobs, everything is good. <laughs> <laughs> like, but she's very fun. She's a woman that she knows what she has and she knows how to use it. And but she's smart. also smart and she's like the brains of the operation of the, all their scheming they're doing. All right. Now the scheming that you're you're doing, it, it, if this all happened to you in, in real life, how do you think your responses would be? Do you think anything similar to what took place in the film? No, 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 no. I'm like, ah, no. El castigo de silencio. You turn around and never look back. Definitely dump them. I, I, these, the girls, you know, are at one point in the movie. You know, she's telling us we don't need this guy to define who we are. Yada yada yada, and we're like, we had, we think that we live in a man's world and it's okay. And then at the end of the movie, you kind of go, hmm, do I really want to live in a man's world? Uh, no. no. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's fun. So um, obviously, there's a lot of Latin characters in here. This is a huge, a bold step for them um, in the in the in the market. But it's more there's more of a universal theme. Can you talk a little bit about that? We're very glad that you sing like that. <laughs> well, I think it's the different one thing, right? That it's yeah. We're just Latin, we're just Hispanic. You know what it is? It. This so, is a universal story. Exactly. Hispanic. This is a universal story that it can happen to any ethnicity, but. We were very blessed that they decided to go with Latinas. Why? Because we bring some flag right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's very beautiful! A little fun actually. We put some salsa. <laughs> and it could have been a um, woman anywhere in the world. Yeah, it's a great story. Yeah. You know, every girl at some point has realized, ooh, was he only wanting me or did he want somebody else too? So, um, you know, it's, it's a story about three women all in love with the same guy. We find out he's cheating on us. Great! What do we do then? That's we go ballistic. Right, right. That's the story. Right. Now, you actually were a Miss Puerto Rico. Right? <laughs> no, now, I'm how did that work? Did you get on a, a podium and then have to talk about world peace? or? <laughs> you know, I never did that. That's, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to defend beauty pageants right now. Do they? Do they? She knows how to do that. <laughs> you know what? It's so sad because everybody that, that, that knows that I was Miss Puerto Rico and whatever, whatever, they always ask, oh, they were catafies. It was a horrible. Were you competing? And at least my experience was great. I didn't have any problems and I didn't talk about. I want to meet the Pope. Uh -huh. You know, none of that. You know, I kept it very. I don't know. Just it yeah, happens. Wasn't well. gratuitous. But right, it's not right. always like that. You right. know what I mean? But of course, the, the the movie because we're making fun and it's a laugh and it's a comedy that we push it and we right, go, right. you know, over the top about it. Exactly. So there's a lot of new people, um, Eduardo, for the first time in, in uh, America doing his film and, and you spending most of your time in music. So how was it? And also the director as well, kind of working with all this. All these fresh ideas and, and new people kind of getting into this for the first time. That was the fun. Amazing. Amazing. That was hard. the fun part. Of it. it was very creative. The whole thing. You know, it's the, it was Linda, Linda Mendoza, the director. Amazing. This is her baby. Yes. Her baby. The first. Her first big film. She comes from a television sitcom. So it was really important to her. It was really important to Jackie because she's very successful and she's very famous at music. Now she has an opportunity to be a, a movie star. So she took it very seriously. Me is. Oh, I, I love doing this all my life. So for me, it's very important and because that's my career. Role. Like you're exactly, starring. and it's like yeah, I'm doing physical comedy. And for Sofia, that is very famous as a personality in the Latino market. Uh, for TV, no, for TV. Yeah. <laughs> this is a new experience for me, and it's I know, so much fun. Do you want to ride? Not so fast, Senorita. <laughs> this spray, Rosalind Sanchez, <laughs> Sofia Vergara, Jackie Velasquez. 
I live in New York.